Welcome back inside the Now Morning Show, ladies and gentlemen. 15 minutes after 7 o'clock, and for this week, we're actually going to feature artisans coming up uh, on the show at 7.15 every morning. So we encourage you to stay tuned. It's going to be a fantastic time. And the first one up is Miss Paulette Narain Singh, a visual artist. Good morning to you, Paulette. Hi, good morning, everybody. Welcome to the Now Morning Show. Thank you. So nice to be here. I'm <laughs> loving the colors that you've brought to this set. Tell me, tell me about your art and your decision to, to use the different materials that you're using to put your art on. Okay, so Art de Jolie started in 2015. I used to teach art for many years. Um, actually, school on the whole education from four right. years old to secondary school. And then I branched off into doing this full time because I found even while teaching, I could not actually do the art that was driving my soul. Mm -hmm. So thanks to an accident <laughs> that had me resign very early from teaching, yeah. um, I decided to follow my passion. And um, these are done as original paintings, first of all, with acrylic paints. Right. And I also use texture with different mediums. And then we scan the artwork and then have them printed in various forms. So some of the things here are um, actual original paintings, like some of these here. Right. These are prints, and we have them. And I thought that I wanted to have my art so that anybody at any time can enjoy it in any way. Yeah. And so I wanted to put them and have them as a utilitarian um, piece. So it's not just to so look at, you can use it. No, the so art. you can use it. So mm -hmm. you have a comfy this when you get home and a cup of tea. <laughs> and then you have the key racks. And actually, it was um, at an upmarket that somebody told me, but you know, my teenager is using these key racks as um, something to hang her jewelry on, and then they were using them in the bathroom and yeah. stuff, so now I call them utility racks. Yeah, ah, yeah, 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 <laughs> okay. And then we have these um, G clay prints, and um, when I first started, I started with just greeting cards, so I did my Christmas collection. This is one of the images that I did um, as a greeting card. Okay. And now it is in the form that you can either hang it or it can stand. Okay. And you also have them in mugs and stuff. And then I went on to painting, um, just because I was very nostalgic and I missed my grandmother, I started with grandma's house, <laughs> which is this one right here. And then it just evolved from there. People started to ask me. I just posted it on Instagram mm -hmm. and um, on WhatsApp, and somebody said, can I have this? And I said, I don't like repeating things. So how about if I do prints of it? and then everybody can have whatever they mm -hmm. like to take away as gifts. And that is what really these have been um, good for a lot of people. And so it's, it's packaged so that it's easy to just remove the back of it here, right. this little stand, and then it's easy to pack in a suitcase. And you can hang and it take as well. away. Yes. And um, these, yes. What's the price like on these things? I mean, it's so not, these aren't all originals. These are prints of the originals. We have prints and originals. So right. I also have them in magnets. Right. Mm -hmm. So the range of, of merch here would be from about $25 to $200. Oh, wow. Okay. That's not bad so at all. Mm -hmm. Normally, just a piece of art alone would start at about three thousand. Yeah, I was just about <laughs> to say, and then exactly. I see that you have um, some DIY stuff as well. Some yes, activities. So we have um, a lot of our black and white um, canvases. Mm -hmm. These are already done, so that you can either put it to stand or it can hang as well. Okay. And these can be painted, mm -hmm. or they can be used. Um, you can use permanent markers on them. Nice. Oh, nice. Yeah. I find they're great gifts and they're so easy, to, you know, when you want to de-stress and relax a bit. Because, yeah, you know, people always think coloring and think it's just for children. No. It's not, guys. No. It, it will help you de-stress as well. It's Trust and believe oh. that. It's <laughs> absolutely fantastic. All right. I understand you wanted to do a demo for us this morning. Yes. Yeah, so, um, I'm just going to do a walkthrough of how I even do the process. Ah, yes. yes. Okay. Nice. So, this is one of my more recent paintings, oh, wow. which can be held really in any direction. <laughs> That's gorgeous. You know, wow. And it's a deep canvas. Mm -hmm. So I paint it around the edges. Nice. Mm. And so to even begin a process like that, I do a lot of sketching. Right. So I do tons of butterflies. I didn't pick that up in the camera. <laughs> okay, it's so it's just number. basically <laughs> um, drawings that to get my brain, you know, going and yeah. figuring out what I want to do in it. And then I outline everything with the black, a black, um, acrylic marker mm -hmm. and then I fill in the colors and then I see that's where my magic happens and my excitement comes in because then I like to decorate each one and just keep adding layers um, to my work 
Why I do the actual outline with the black is because for about 20 years, I was actually a textile artist and I worked um, doing batik and um, fabric painting and stuff. And then of course with the batik, it's like arthritis sets in and then mm. you had all these reactions, the chemicals, and I said, okay, how do I do this now in a different way? And so I decided to do it with my um, acrylic paints. Right. And I still keep the outlines in that black. would act as my wax resist. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so that's my little story yeah. on that. <laughs> so with some of your pieces, I know you mentioned that some of them, of course, have been printed. But would you yes. say then that you will have some unique pieces that are not going to be doubled anyway? Oh, yes. Wonderful. So let me take a little walk around and show you something. So just to see, um, during this pandemic, I went through many different emotions mm -hmm. and painting just, it just wasn't happening. The creativity wasn't happening. I was very stressed. So I decided to do a 30 day challenge. Oh, okay. And so I did mini art pieces like these mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then um, like these. So these are originals, All right? right. And, and I just needed, uh, yeah, some of them. Okay. I only um, printed some because some people wanted um, to s and they're only going to be limited editions, right. you no know, more than 20 anyway, Okay. right? But there are others that I do not have um, that I will not be doing as prints. But just to show you, so this is a four by four. Mm -hmm. This is a six by six. Right. So the same thing. You yeah. Yes. Okay. So this is the print and this is the original. But I'm saying like if you wanted to do like a set of these on a wall yeah. or something, you can do. You do ever get image. concerned about quality loss when it, like if you painted that small and they, and they blew it up to be bigger? No, look. It I have a really good guy. Yeah, you have a good <laughs> nothing, guy. <laughs> nothing, <laughs> trust me, listen, this was five years of pain and struggling to get people to do things the way you wanted. And yeah. then when you find somebody, thank you very much, Darren. Shout out to Darren there. <laughs> he, I, I mean, I recommend him totally. How can know? people um, get in contact with you if they want to m purchase some of these things? Because, I mean, yeah. this is beautiful. So, Arte Jolie, our studio is in Glencoe, mm -hmm. and it's open until the day before Christmas Eve. Um, so you can call and you can come along um, by making an appointment. Or if you call me at 344-4025, we can do a virtual, say a WhatsApp video or something that okay. you can choose Ooh. the piece that you would like and then through TT Post. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or I can deliver it to you if you're in around the if area East enough. West. Yeah. Right. Other than that, I am at the products are in um, Sure things in Tobago, right. Lambo. We are at Carrie's Craft at the airport. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I hope I remember everybody. The greetings <laughs> in Mid Center Mall, Terbeni at Normandy, and Craft Creators in West Mall. So I try to get it in, in yeah. all and of the areas. You also have a, a website people can go to as yes, well. Yes, it's www. Uh, uh, just Lord. in case you're wondering, about, well, the spelling is up on the screen so you yeah. can see. Um, how it's how it's spelt, and you also have Instagram and Facebook. That people Instagram can go and, find and you Facebook. As well. Yes, and I try to post as very often. <laughs> 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 With doing being a one man person and trying to get everything done, I mean, I have laps these days. Oh, I also have painted pots, and those are originals. Ooh. You do not get um, copies Prince. of those. Yeah, and a print no. of the paint. And even pots, if somebody right. like I just did one with um, water lilies and that whole lily pond scene, and somebody wanted one like it so i just did a different version of yeah. it because i'm not painting the same thing twice, twice. <laughs> so we'll be able to see that and more i would think on your oh website yes. um on the instagram and facebook page mm -hmm. the website we the website actually things ship from the u.s so that um anybody who just wants to send a gift out um internationally can do that mm -hmm. we also have a local page so that they can see some of the things that we have here and then, but at Instagram and Facebook, you would see all of my pots. Wonderful. Right. And then we have these little crossbody bags. Just a little plug in for my bags. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think the kids wear them bags now too. Well, Paulette, I want to thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank and you congratulations so much for having me. This. <laughs> this is fantastic. It's beautiful. And I, I look forward to everybody going out and supporting. Head across yep. to artdejolie.com where you can check out on Instagram, on Facebook, and you can get the contact information. And you can support us. Great gifts to get us. Unique gifts to get. I mean... I take in coffee cups just in case anybody was wondering. Coffee cups. Right? Yeah, definitely. Okay, I take noted. in coffee cups. All right. <laughs> Thank you again, Paulette. We're going to take a quick Thank break and come back with much. more inside in our morning show. Stay tuned.